Hi friends, welcome to my channel and this is the 13th video in Windows Server 2016 tutorial and in this video I'm going to show you how to install and configure print server role on Windows Server 2016 so here is my demo environment I'm using three virtual machine here the first machine is Win2K16 DC01 you can see I haven't selected React and DNS role on this machine let's verify this so here it is you can see ActiveDirect and DNS role is running on local server you can verify the name and my domain name is victorinfosol.com computer name so this is my domain controller which is uh, running ActiveDirect and DNS both this, both the roles and my second server is win2k12 ps01 main sprint server 01 so this machine is joined in my domain victorinfosol and I have assigned 8 GB RAM to this machine if you want to verify here you can I have not installed any role any feature yet on this machine so this machine is freshly installed with 2016 standard edition and I have renamed this computer configure IP address and this machine is joining in my domain victorinfosol.com if you want to check you can check victorinfosol.com so this machine is joined in my domain and the last machine is my client machine windows 8.1 client machine this is also join in my domain here you can see and if you want you can see the this machine is also join in my domain and here you can verify the domain name and computer name victim for soul and computer name and I have assigned 2 GB RAM to this machine so so we have one active directory server we have one print server uh, bare ma machine uh, which is installed with 2016 and we have a one client machine so let's move to next slide so step by step task to install and configure print server so th we need some prerequisites like configure IP address name server and join in domain so we have done this on for our print server all the three tasks prerequisites is done IP address is configured the machine is renamed and machine is joined in domain so let's do now further so install print server role on server from server manager so on, a, on our print server I click on manage add role and features you can click next and role based on feature based installation click next and next and here we need to select print and document services so add features required features can be added here and on a feature page don't select anything just click next and here you can see print and document services what it's providing so we have some things to note and click next and here we have a print server include print management snap in used to manage the print multi multiple prints or print server so we need to install a print server only for now so click next and click on install button so it will take around one to two minutes to get the installation done for print server so we'll see how it's work so once the installation is finished we will go to next step which is configure print server role and install in domain demo printers so wait for this step once the installation is done we will proceed further install and succeeded on win2k16 ps01 go ahead and close this now if you go here you can see print server rule is installed so we are getting the print server on our server manager dashboard so to configure print server go to tools and need to click on print management so here we have a print management this is showing what we have we have two printers which is by default printer microsoft print 2 pdf and xpx document writer and we have total six driver mapped with this print server so let's move to print server here you can see we have print server which is local and we have driver here we have forms we have port and these all details so to configure this we to add a new printer we can go ahead and add first port so I'm going to add a port as a TCP IP port this is demo printer so I'm going to put here like IP 192.168.100.151 and it will detect the printer so for now I have not connected any printer on my network 
so it will just detect a uh, printer and it will create a port for us so in real environment if you have a multiple printers in your infrastructure you can go ahead and add the port uh, by using the IP address and if you have made entry in your DNS for the printers with their uh, their IP address you can map the uh, create a port with the IP address or host them both so wait for this so it's not be able to find because I don't have any physical printer connector so it's giving the device is not found on the network if you have device on network then it will find the device so it's giving some information like device is turned off network is connected device is properly configured like for IP address and everything and for me it's a demo environment so I'm going with the generic network card and finish so now if I close here uh, you can see I have created one port with this IP address and drivers also you can add so I'm going to add a driver which is pre-installed so 64 bit I'm going to install click next and we I'm going to select HP just for example we can install HP 11005 classic driver click finish and now we have a driver here now I'm finally I'm going to add a printer so I'm going to use my port which is we have created so 192.168.1.151 click next and now we need to select the driver which we can so I'm going to select HP laser Z and, and call it like HP laser Z this you can put or you can put this also and share name as per your need so I'm going to share use the CNM same and location you can put here like first floor HP printer whatever you can put here printer and comments for like this printer is in HR room and we can go ahead and click next and now it's installing driver and now you can see if you go here we have a printer and we have uh, everything here like the server name printer status and if you go to properties able to see here all the details like like here you can see the details and preferences also and setting we have this option here and if you want to list this printer in directory you can go ahead and select this and click apply then it will automatically register in your DNS and your Active Directory and you can see also port details if you want to change the port details later on you can change and in advance you can change the driver if you want to change the driver and we have color management also here if you want you can change the color settings and go to print set printing default you can change here if you want to change any settings like if you want to make it A4 paper size you can go ahead and make it A4 so also here you can see so now we are good to go to install this printer on our our client machine so for that we need to go to print server which is Win2K 16 hyphen ps01 hit enter and now we have a printer here and you just need to right click and open or connect it will automatically connect to printer so now you can see here printer is connected and you can also set this is set as my default printer but because this is my first printer so to check this also you can go here printer is mapped with us so go to you can go to devices and printers 
you can see here we have a printer installed and you can also see the details given there like from which server it's mapped and also if you go here on details you can see the all details here and if you want to go more and see like model status everything you can see what driver is installed what is model so so this is all about how to uh, install and configure paint server role and how to install a printer's driver and create port on how to install the same printer f uh, from server print server to client machine so thank you for watching and please subscribe me for more videos and if you have any query any question related to this please post me on my given mail ids thank you once again bye bye